this guy. Real quick, I want to make a disclaimer that this place is huge and essentially a giant jungle gym. If you're hoping for a quiet, relaxing museum visit, this ain't it. For the purpose of this video, I've reduced the sound and selected clips as needed, but this place was loud. There were a ton of people and there was a lot of clanking metal going on because the museum is still under renovation. This was a Friday morning and it was still crowded. Don't let that discourage you from making your visit though. We were able to occasionally find low traffic areas and the museum is ever expanding. Oh my god, this is so cool. And you can climb all the way up there, but I'm not sure I'm brave enough to do that. I'm sitting on the wing of an airplane right now. Hey, Bennett. It's a little weird. Concerned. I know, I was standing on the wing and I was like, I can feel this thing shaking. I wish I could have gotten better footage of the first floor because it is definitely the most completed portion of the museum, but it was also the most crowded area. We went ahead and followed the room to the end and ventured into the caves, which led us to the other levels. This part of the museum seemed like it was meant for younger ages as there are plenty of small tunnels that most adults likely wouldn't be able to use. There's also an abundance of seating in this area, which allowed parents to be able to sit and watch for their children. I really enjoyed the caves. There was a ton of art sculpted into the walls of the caves, but the dim lighting did make me a little anxious that I was about to step on a small child running about. We made our way up where we met this cool guy playing the piano, and we continued our way up through 10 flights of stairs to ride the slide all the way down. Unfortunately, much of the aquarium wasn't quite finished yet, but it was exciting to see, you know, some of the work that was being done to the exhibits. This was one of my favorite exhibits at the museum and my camera doesn't do it justice at all. Josh happened to take a clip at the same time and the way that the fog moves around and how the light seems to cinch up my waist is just the coolest.
We're actually waiting in line on the third floor here to take a three-story slide down to the first floor. After going up to the other levels and taking the slide back down, we decided to walk around the first floor to see some of the things we had missed. We walked through the whale and this is an overhead view of the fish in the pond that I had shown before. <laughs> 